Hello. Are you a journalist, a student journalist? From? From City University. Wonderful. Well, how did you hear about tonight? Uh, just uh, researching, looking for uh, stories for the, this week and um, obviously heard about what's going on uh, in, this, in this instance tonight. Um, but it seems like there's a lot of support on one side and at the moment. We're waiting for um, something to happen, but it doesn't seem to be happening. So, yeah, I, I, same as you, just waiting at the moment. <laughs> Sorry, you said from the City University? Yeah. A newspaper? A uh, broadcast. Broadcast. Is uh, it done? Ra radio and TV. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. No, it's, it's, it's been very good. Uh, we'll just put the package together for tomorrow. So <laughs> hoping, hoping we get a bit of movement here. In the news today, nothing happened at a protest. It's been a, it's been a very, very quiet news today, Jim. Relatively busy this morning. <laughs> it's interesting. I got two people recording me. Yeah, it's very interesting to like see. A celebrity. Yeah, to hear what you have to say. Obviously, you came here to say it. Uh, my name is Spell, uh, and I'm here basically to see what's going on. I heard that something might be happening this evening, so I thought I'd come along and have a look. Well, I heard that there was a Auntie Assange protests, people who believe that he committed the crimes that he has been accused of, um, and having, having arrived, there are no people um, in, well, there are, no, there are no people of that bench in the pen set up for them, but there are uh, roughly 20 <coughs> pro Assange um, people here, which is quite interesting, one of them is filming me as we speak. <laughs> He's quite uh, I'm a little surprised, yes. Um, generally, I expect um, protests by students to be a little bit more exciting than zero people. Um, but students are generally very good at getting protests started, so I am surprised there is nobody here. Uh, why do you think there was a suggestion of a protest meeting? Oxford students are uncomfortable. Uh, I believe Assange is giving a speech in Oxford University via video. Um, and I think that they think that that is wrong and that he should face the charges that he has been accused of. Whether he's been actually charged with anything or not, they think he should face those charges. <laughs> I think given our country's previous support for people who have who have been accused of or have been proven to do um, dubious things. For example, Thatcher's um, association with various dictators. There's very little we can say as a country in terms of defending ourselves from allegations like that. And if it goes ahead as planned, what do you think it says about Oxford Uni? Um, I think it says that Oxford Uni have read the, read the facts and they've come to the conclusion that they believe the cri that he committed the crimes he is accused of, and they very firmly believe that rape should not be able to be got away with. If they believe that he committed rape and they turn up to protest, it's them showing that they think that rape is always wrong, even if someone who does work that they agree with is the person committing it. Thank you very much. Thank you too. You're welcome.